Hello, welcome to Forest Fires. I'm Forest, and I'm here today to show you all the books that I bought in the month of May. Starting with Acceptance by Jeff Vandermeer. Now this is the third book in the Southern Reach trilogy, which I am reviewing one by one on my channel and trying my best to keep the reviews spoiler free. These are a sci-fi suspense um, set of books. So if you are into things like if you liked Lost, the TV show Lost, I know it's so annoying how it ended, but if you like that um, that feeling, then you might enjoy these books a lot. The next book that I picked up is The Raven and Other Tales by Edgar Allan Poe, no other. And I wanted to update my Poe collection because the the one that I had on my shelf I've had since maybe sixth grade or something like that and um I'll show you it's very ugly <laughs> um well maybe you like this sort of thing but it's just you know I you're probably gonna hear me say a lot in my videos how much I don't like glossy I'm much more into matte and it's all yellowed now, which is fun when books get like that. But I just thought this one was so pretty with the black and the bold blue raven. And of course, on the back, the iconic quote, quote the raven nevermore. So that was a fun buy and um, really cheap because it was on clearance. Also, in one of my previous hauls, uh, my friend had gifted me The Summer I Turned Pretty by Jenny Han, which is the first book in a trilogy, The Summer I Turned Pretty trilogy. And so I picked up the second and third books. The second one is It's Not Summer Without You. And the last is We'll Always Have Summer. So I haven't read the first book yet, but I figured I'd complete the set. And the last two books I got are Middle Grade um, fantasy books and they just look so pretty. I've wanted them for a really long time. Um, it's the Mapmakers trilogy. The first book is The Glass Sentence. The writer is S.E. Grove and The Glass Sentence, the cover, um, you see this like in the back? That's actually on the hardback because the dust jacket is clear like um, tracing paper. So that's the um, the hardback. And I make an exception with this one because this is a really pretty glossy cover. Um, I'm not really sure what these books are about. Um, the little quote on the front or blurb on the front says one sentence can reveal the world's most powerful secret. Um, so I'm pretty excited to get into this. And then the second book um, is The Golden Specific. This doesn't have the tracing paper like dust jacket, but it has a really cool dust jacket where this compass, I guess it is, is raised and the font is raised. And then the actual book itself is this really pretty purple with gold lettering. So those are all the books that I hauled in May. And I also got a gift from the same friend who gifted me the book. Um, she went to England and she picked me up this Jane Austen notebook because I love Jane Austen. And I have a little collection going um, of Jane Austen items. And I don't know if she knows this, but on the front it even has a quote. It says, and examine their own indifferent imitations, which I think is from Pride and Prejudice. I'm not that into Jane Austen that I would know that off the top of my head. But I think it is from Pride and Prejudice. Um, so those that's all the books and the book related things that I got in May. Um, what did you pick up? Do you have any of these books? Um, and what did you think of them? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. And don't forget to subscribe. I hope you stop by again soon. Bye!